Uh, Foreign Minister Brenda, it's very good to welcome you again uh, to Jerusalem. Uh, you're a friend. We had, uh, I thought, a very important uh, discussion encompassing uh, many areas that uh, are important to our quest for peace and security in a turbulent region. Um, much of the world's attention is now focused on the savagery that occurred in uh, Paris. Uh, Israel joins all free nations in condemning yesterday's butchery in uh, the capital of France. We express uh, profound sympathies to the government of France, the people of France, and we extend our condolences to the families of the victims and our wishes for a speedy recovery for the injured. Yesterday's murderous attack on free expression clearly demonstrates the disdain of radical Islam for the values we hold dear. We cherish freedom and tolerance. They worship tyranny and terror. And through this terror, they seek to impose a new dark age on humanity. These extremists are part of a global movement, and this necessitates a global response. I believe that with the strength of our resolve and the unity of our action, we can defeat this threat to our common civilization. But what the battle against terror requires is courage, clarity, and consistency. Israel is being attacked by the same forces that attack Europe. Israel stands with Europe. Europe must stand with Israel. And in this spirit, I welcome you again to Jerusalem. Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Prime Minister. Thank you for this very uh, cordial uh, reception uh, again. Uh, also, thank you for letting me feel like home with snow in uh, Jerusalem. Um, I it's a warm meeting on a cold day in Jerusalem. Yeah, yeah. It is. And, and thank you for your friendship. Also, I would like to second uh, what you were raising about uh, terrorism, extremism, uh, what took place in Paris. Uh, yes, yesterday was an uh, appalling act of terrorism intolerance that uh, we condemn in the strongest way. I think uh, democracies um, have to stand up against uh, this kind of intolerance and extremism. Uh, we will not have terrorists uh, eradicating uh, our values. Uh, like this. We will stand up and we will continue uh, speaking our mind. We will not let them define um, what uh, we will uh, use as language and how we will convey uh, our uh, messages. So it's good to be back in, uh, in Israel. Um, and uh, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.